Hey guys, I'm back with another video. Hopefully I actually upload this one because I have a problem with recording videos and not uploading them. Um, this one that you can see from the title is a Bath and Body Works haul. It was gonna be a 650 single wick haul, but I got some three wicks also. So this is just gonna be a Bath and Body Works uh, fall kind of haul because fall is my favorite. That's really the only time I buy Bath & Body Works candles when they're on sale for one and they have to be the fall scents because I don't really mess with no other scents. Anywho, I'm going to try not to take forever getting this video going because I tend to do that and talk too much. We're just going to jump into it. So I ordered, um, I have 16 single wick candles, but it's only eight cents. I got two of each scent that I purchased. This is my first time purchasing single wick candles um from the website i usually go into the store because um i like to smell the candles especially with single wicks that's kind of how i try candles out i like to smell them um so i usually just go to the store but i never ordered online i just wanted to quickly show you how they came uh packaged i don't the box is over there on the floor um but they came in these little cardboards which i thought was really cute just so you know it keeps everything together so they don't fall out I'm sorry about the lighting I hope it's not too bad um, so they don't fall out so they all came in their individual little cardboard just wanted to go ahead and show you that I've never I've ordered from Bath and Body Works a few times online but I've never had an issue with a broken candle just so you know um but we just gonna go ahead and jump into it so the first thing I have is I have two of them there's no need for me to really show both of them um, this one is pumpkin apple. Hopefully the glare from the light isn't too bad. Pumpkin apple. Um, the packaging is cute. I like the, a little dusty. The gold top, because their tops are usually black. So that's like a cute little change. This light is like ridiculous. Anyway, um, these don't have the scent notes on the bottom. I'm, I'm making this video because I like to tell people what the scent notes are and what it really smells like and how strong it is and all that good jazz because just reading the scent description on the website just isn't it all the time. I need someone to have the candle in their hand and tell me what it smells like, but that's just me. Anyway, this one is pumpkin apple. The scent notes are red apple, fall pumpkin, fresh cinnamon, and clove buds. So, yeah. This is very fall. It's giving me very much apple pie, uh, but more so the filling to an apple pie, not necessarily the crust bakery scent. And you do get um, some pumpkin, but it's a lot of apple. And I'm normally not a fan of apple scents of any kind. I stay away from apple. I don't like it, but this smells really good. It's like a refreshing fall scent. I usually go for the bakery scents, as you will find out in a moment um but this is like a refreshing clean nice fresh fall scent so you definitely get the um apple it smells like apple pie filling with a little bit of pumpkin to me i like it the reason why i tried this scent was because um i tried it in the room spray because i was like mm, i don't know if i'm gonna like it let me just get this room spray because it was on sale for like 350 see if I like it and I have been loving that apple pumpkin so apple pumpkin um the next one I have and like I said I have a list of the scent notes because it doesn't say it on the bottom like the three wick candles the next one is um marshmallow fireside bath and body works classic I'm pretty sure everyone has smelled marshmallow fireside definitely one of my favorites I have well, not on this shelf. I have another shelf like this on the other side of my TV um, with just candles. I will show you, but my bed is kind of junky right now. So we're not going to pan the camera over there. Um, but I have two, three wicks that I've been like babysitting, not really wanting to light much because I didn't have any other ones. But anyway, Marshmallow Fireside is Toasted Marshmallow, Smoldering Woods, Fire Roasted Vanilla, and Amber. And it's amazing. Mm, it smells so good. 
It's like sweet, smoky marshmallow goodness. I don't even know how to describe it. But if you know, you know. You know about marshmallow fireside. It's very smoky, woodsy, but sweet marshmallowy, if that makes sense. Marshmallow Fireside is a classic. If Jesus, sorry. If you haven't tried it, I highly recommend that you do because Marshmallow Fireside is amazing. Um, then this one is Ghoul Friends. Ghoul, Ghoul Friends. Ghoul Friend. Um, this one is Dark Strawberries, Peony, and Citrus. It smells interesting. I get the strawberry and the peony, pe peony, if if I'm saying that right, and a little bit of citrus at the end. It's good. This is a good year-round scent. Really like summer. Not really a fall scent, um, but it's like a Halloween scent. But it's really it doesn't give me fall because it's like citrus floral. But it's a really good candle. I recommend it. it smells really good. So that's Ghoul Friend. The next one I have is Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, which is maple syrup, waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. Everybody knows about Pumpkin Pecan Waffles. Who don't? It smells amazing. Mm, this is so good. This is like the fall scent of all fall scents. Like as far as like bakery scents because this is just mm. and it's so strong so so strong marshmallow fire side i have definitely tried and it's definitely a strong scent gives a good throw um these other two that i already showed i haven't had in candle form so i don't know how they perform i'm not sure but marshmallow fire side and pumpkin pecan waffles is it okay this smells so so good like I don't even know you get like how like the pecan like really stands out and then you get like that waffle syrup type of vibe but you also get the pumpkin like how do you pick up on all of these scents and they come at different times it's just so weird I don't know the science behind it but this right here is like fall in a jar for me fall bakery in a jar Ugh. pumpkin pumpkin pecan waffles is just it for me so that's pumpkin pecan waffles the next one i have is pumpkin bonfire pumpkin bonfire this one is white pumpkin clove buds and glowing amber um i've had this i think i had this in a three way this is like you first get the clove buds and the amber then you get a light pumpkin scent so i think this can also be like a manly scent is what I'm getting from this it smells so good though it low-key reminds me of marshmallow fireside minus the sweetness from marshmallow fireside this is very manly like a man can use this candle and not feel like he lives with a woman well maybe he does I don't know um but it's definitely a man a manly scent with a teeny tiny bit, not a teeny tiny bit, but you don't get as much pumpkin. You get more so the other scents, which is uh, clove buds and glowing embers. Uh, but white pumpkin is not really a strong, strong scent. I did have a white pumpkin candle from Bath and Body Works, and it wasn't really. You, it was a strong scent. It had good throw, but that's just, mm, that's just not a strong fragrance, the white pumpkin, in my opinion. So... That was the pumpkin bonfire. If you're a man or you have a man, excuse my TV, sorry, um, who likes to light candles, they like fall scents, I highly recommend a pumpkin bonfire. That smells really good. The next one I have, which is new to me, and I don't know if I said I had this in a three wick also, the pumpkin bonfire. Um, but this one is new. This one is caramel pumpkin swirl. This one is caramel, cinnamon, brown sugar, and creamy vanilla this one smells so good i do have this in a three wick three yeah i said that right um which i'll show you in a minute but i smelled the three wick and i was like oh my goodness i have to have 
more of that. So, um, so yeah, no, actually I bought the single wicks first and was like, mm, let me try this. It had amazing reviews. Then I was like, mm, I might need a three wick also. So I got the three wicks second. These I bought first and fell in love. Read reviews. I watch videos also. Oh, the smell just hit me in the face. Um, but definitely, definitely read reviews because they are very helpful. Um, but yeah, this is Caramel Pumpkin Swirl. Um, I don't know if I said already, Caramel Cinnamon Brown Sugar and Creamy Vanilla. This is so good. <sighs> like, I get everything. I definitely get the pumpkin, the cinnamon, the vanilla, caramel. This is like, if you're a fan of like cinnamon, caramel, sweet candles, then this one is for you. The Caramel Pumpkin Swirl. This smells so good. I can't wait to light it. I haven't lit any of the ones I have yet, but this is like fall sweetness, cinnamon goodness in a jar. This is so good. I highly, highly recommend. I highly recommend this one. The Caramel Pumpkin Swirl. The next one I have is Summer Boardwalk. Um, this one is Caramel Popcorn taffy apples in salty sweet cream um i wasn't sure about this i've seen this candle plenty of times before um and it was like mm, i don't know i'm funny about my caramel popcorn scents i don't know because i love me some caramel popcorn um i can smell it already this is interesting though this is an interesting candle the first set is caramel popcorn you get that, but that's not... The first scent that's listed on the website is caramel popcorn, and you get that, but not at first. It's very... Um, you get the apple scent. Then you get some of the cream, and then you get the buttery popcorn. It's so... It's like the scents are so like salty, cream, caramel, popcorn, like apple, like the freshness of the apple, and it's just... The scents are everywhere, so it makes this candle, like, super interesting. I'm, like, still trying to figure it out. I know I like it, but what do I like about it? It's so interesting. This is a year-round candle, for sure. Because you get, like, caramel to me is, like, fall. The caramel cinnamon, like, the caramel is fall. So you get fall, you get the apple for, like, summer. You get the sweet cream. Like, it's, like, a transitional year-round candle in my opinion so this is a good one i definitely would buy this again buy more of them because i can use it year-round because i'm very picky about when i use my candles like i don't really use candles much in the summer because i'm more of a fan of the fall scents and bakery scents which i feel like go with the fall winter <laughs> so i don't really like candles that much in the summer i'm weird i know whatever but this is a year-round candle. So I don't know if I showed that already. Summer Boardwalk. That's a keeper. Um, next one I have is Sweater Weather. One of my all-time faves. I will say that Sweater Weather is not for everyone. The scent notes are fresh, fresh sage, juniper berries, eucalyptus, and fresh woods. Now... I've been buying sweater weather for a long time and I do know that that fresh woods won't in there before. It was just sage, juniper berries, and eucalyptus. So I don't know. I don't really smell a difference. It smells just like sweater weather normally smells. I love this candle. It's like, like fall. I don't know why it's fall, but it just reminds me of fall. Um, I hope that's not bothering anyone my candle it's so weird so sorry if it is just ignore that um but this is like so full i don't know what about it is fall but it is just so fall mm. i don't like it's like the eucalyptus the juniper i don't know this is just so good if you are a fan of sweater weather you know sweater weather you know i recommend just try it even if you try like a room spray or you know, when single wicks are on sale, I suggest you try it. This is also good for when you're sick because of the eucalyptus. My son loves 
sweater weather. He loves this candle. Anytime I light it, he's like, he comes in my room like, yes, that is my favorite. He loves this because I lit this candle and he was sick one day and I let him come in my room and lay down because, you know, kids want to be up under their mama when they're sick. And I had this lit and the eucalyptus is like really soothing and it helps to like clear you up. And this is a really, really strong candle. Sorry. A really, really strong candle. So I definitely recommend Sweater Weather. It's just so full to me. It's so full. I don't know. So that's Sweater Weather. And then the last single wick that I have is Strawberry Pound Cake. And I'm looking down at the scent notes just so anyone, you know, any questions. Um, strawberry Pound Cake is Strawberries Golden Shortcake in Whipped Cream. This is just a really basic packaging that they have. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. This is another year-round candle for me because the strawberries give me like spring summer vibes, but then you got the pound cake that gives me fall vibes. So this is another year-round candle. This smells so good. And I'm going to tell you right now, I haven't had their strawberry pound cake candle. Um, I know it's amazing though because... My sister and my 16-year-old niece live by a strawberry pound cake. Um, but I did smell it in a store a few years ago. And, like, the whole... They had a three-wick lit by, like, their sink. You know, they always get, like, a sink in Bath and Body Works. And the whole store smelled like strawberry pound cake. And I was trying to figure out, like, where is this scent coming from? It smells so good. I need it. Um, and then they told me that it was the candle that they had lit. But they only had it in the three-wick at that time. And... I wasn't paying $25 for the three wick. So, yeah. It might have been like $24. Yeah, that $24.50. I wasn't paying that much for the three wick at that time. Anywho, I know that this scent is bomb.com. I know this is a good scent. Mmm, it smells so good. This smells so good. If you like strawberry pound cake from any, like, brand or anywhere, Mom? this scent is for you. This scent is for you if you're a fan of strawberry pound cake from just when you make fresh strawberry pound cake buy it from the store a wax melt another candle a spray a perfume whatever this is for you this smells so good it's giving me fresh strawberries at first like a strawberry jam type of vibe but then you get that pound cake oh it smells so good mmm I ain't never want to lick a candle until I met strawberry pound cake. <laughs> this candle smells so good. I definitely want to lick it. Um, I won't though. Uh, but that was it for my single wick. So I only have four uh, three wick candles. I'm going to just try to get through really quick. Uh, the first one I have is the caramel pumpkin swirl. Just like I have the single wick. So... That's that one. We already talked about the caramel pumpkin swirl, which is, oh, the description is on these ones. Um, it actually says luscious caramel, ground cinnamon, rich brown sugar, creamy vanilla with natural essential oils. Um, that smells so good. I don't like, I highly recommend this one. If you are a fan of fall cinnamon caramel type of vibes, I highly, highly suggest this one. It smells so good and I can't wait to light it. I'm not going to light it yet because it gives me like strong fall vibes and it isn't fall yet. So I'm probably not going to light that till like October. I'm going to let that one sit. Um, <laughs> the other one I have is pumpkin clove, which is clove buds, ground cinnamon, a pinch of nutmeg and fresh pumpkin. It smells, it's, it's super strong. Um, the first thing you get is the clove buds. The clove is really strong in this, but I like it. You get the pumpkin and you get the nutmeg. It's like that spice type of vibe with the pumpkin. It's a strong scent and I really love this. I actually already have this candle in a three wick, but I love it so much. Um, I like to use that candle when I'm cleaning for some reason. I don't know why, but it's a strong spice type of scent great for fall like open the windows clean your house real good like that clove pumpkin clove that's it then the next one i have is i feel like this is a year-round candle for me also 
This one is pineapple pound cake. The set notes are fresh pineapple, sweet vanilla pound cake, sprinkled with powdered sugar. It smells good. It's not like, mmm, this is it, this is the one. It does smell good. You get the pineapple, but it's not, it says fresh pineapple. It's not giving me like super fresh pineapple vibes. I don't know. It smells good. You can definitely smell the pineapple. But it's not giving me super fresh pineapple. Like these apple ones give me super fresh apple vibes. This doesn't give me super fresh pineapple vibes. But it smells like pineapple, if that makes sense. Not super artificial, but I don't know. I don't know how to put it. But it's not like a super strong pineapple scent. And you definitely get like a bakery scent in it. I don't know how well this is going to perform because the scent is not super, super strong. I don't know. It smells good though. I like it. But it's not like a super, super strong, this is it, you got to get it type of candle. I need to light that and test it out. So my last single wick, which, I mean not single wick, three wick, which um, you'll be able to tell that I absolutely love. This one is Toasted coconut cupcake as you can see it's been used by me not you know I didn't buy it used this candle smells so good okay so the scent notes are sweet coconut toasted almonds fluffy vanilla cake I didn't really know there was almond in it this smells so good like this smells so good and the scent is really strong when you the cold throw is not that strong but I promise you when you light this it's really strong not like super strong not like mahogany teak wood or anything like that but it's definitely a strong scent you will smell it throughout your house this smells so good like I don't even know how like where to begin describing this candle it smells so good like the toasted coconut you get that almond, but then you get a little bit of a bakery scent. Not much bakery scent, but you get the bakery scent. I'm telling you, this candle, I'm not good at describing things, but out of all these candles I bought, this is the only one that I lit so far. Don't ignore, ignore the wicks. They need to be trimmed. But you can see that I definitely have been using it. Like this is, this candle is like bomb. Like I had to call the store to make sure to see if they had more of this particular scent because it's just so good i definitely recommend if you are a fan of coconut i'm not even a big fan of coconut but this smells so good so if you're a fan of coconut you're going to love this you get a little bit of that almond and you get a little bit of a bakery scent this is so good i wish i found it in a single wick because what i like to do is light my three wick in a bigger open space and then in like my room or um somewhere else in the house i'll put a single wick so the whole house is just like smellingbomb.com anywho that is it for my haul if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below um i can't wait to light these candles i feel like i'm gonna have them forever i already have so many candles I want to show you my candle thing so bad, but my bed is a mess. Um, but that's it for my candle haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more videos. I do a lot of um, like haul videos. I started out wanting to be like really creative and make things. And I do have a few creative videos on my channel. But for the most part, I like doing hauls showing you what I got because that's what I like watching on YouTube honestly um but anywho don't forget to like and subscribe comment down below if you have any questions or if these are any candles that you have and you love or what you don't like about these candles um and stay tuned for my next video hopefully soon I need to get it together I'm working on it but uh yeah stay tuned for my next video and I'll see you guys next time bye